Hey guys, this is Omar Ruiz from the ATG support team. Today I'd like to talk about the new feature in Revit 2021. It's related to the voids and how we can control the visibility of them. Uh, in the past, when I have created a, a void um, for, for the geometry to cut, I always have to to create a lot of parameters, reference planes, in order to control if it, if it can cut the, the host or not. And it's just a lot of extra work. Uh, we get it to do what it needs to, but um, now with the new feature, it's made it easier. What I'm, I'm here right now, I'm gonna create a really quick void around the edges of the table. And I'm gonna select my path. I'm gonna pick the plane where I want my path to go, and then just pick the edges. I'm selecting tab to select all the edges around, and finish. The next step is to uh, create the the profile so I'm gonna edit the profile and we're just gonna create something around it really quick here so uh, 45 degrees and then just uh, some radius any I'm not being picking what I'm selecting right now just something to show quick so we're gonna finish and then finish again as you can see it cut the edge of the table okay in the past like I said uh, it would be an extra set of parameters and reference planes to move this thing out of the way to not cut it or cut it back. But now as well I select the void, um, I have this cut geometry available. So I can unselect it and it doesn't cut anymore as you can see. Or I can select it again and cut it. Um, I can also link it to a parameter if I wanted to so I can do this um, has round edge. Put on the graphics as an instance, okay, and okay. So now this family will be able to be controlled by this parameter in the project when it's loaded. And it's you could have a table with a, a straight angle or a rounded edge in there. I hope this is useful for you. Let us know if you have any questions. Uh, reach us at support at atgusa.com. Uh, we look forward to seeing uh, and hearing from you there. Thanks. Yeah. <laughs>